new during an open house. David Keller with Mr. Code's Wild Ride, cute name, joins us live with more. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, so what, for people like me, what is coding and what does it allow you to do? What is coding? All right. Um, so, you know, everything in this world, from your websites to games, apps, traffic lights, self driving cars, they all run behind code. So, programmers, they write code to make these things and make it all work. All right. So, it's like a language. And so, so here, you're teaching the kids to do this, right? Correct. This is an after school program. Kids come in and they're building their own uh, web apps and games. Uh, at the beginning, I, I guide them through my curriculum where they learn all the programming fundamentals, but uh, the end goal is they build what they want to build, their own apps and games and websites. Why is this such a big deal for them to get started early? Why is it such a big deal? Well, first of all, it's just a lot of fun. It's way better than playing video games. You have a lot more creativity. You can, uh, you know, build stuff. Uh, so it fosters creativity, uh, it builds our analytical skills, so it'll be better at, you know, things that aren't related to code like math and science. Uh, and also, as the world gets more digitized and automated, there will be more and more programming jobs. Everything will be written with code. So it's, this is like the future, really important to know about code. Now, where did you get the background in, do, in doing this class? And is this just here locally, or are you kind of all over the place? Uh, right now, I'm just local. I'm in Folsom, and I teach uh, also at various homeschool locations around the Sacramento area. Uh, I got the inspiration because I learned coding when I was 13 years old at a place kind of similar to this. Uh, and it really transformed my childhood. I went from playing video games all the time, much to my parents' chagrin, <laughs> to actually making my, making my own games. And my parents loved it because I was being creative and I was actually like building skills. Eventually got a degree in computer science, a uh, program for about nine years. And decided, you know what? It's time to pass it on to the next generation of 13-year-olds. So what that's why I decided to start Mr. Codes. What do you find that the kids are most uh, excited about learning? Is it how to make those games, how to uh, code their own games? Uh, for the most part, yes. Kids love playing video games, and their dream is to make video games. So yeah, one guy here, he's making a Connect 4. Uh, but it's not just limited to games. Uh, a lot of my kids make apps as well. Uh, actually, let's, let's go over here. Hey, Nicholas, why don't you, uh, why don't you tell the audience what, what, you've, what you've built? Friend anybody, and this as a test, I can do this. David, you and know what? We're having trouble hearing him because like he that. doesn't have a mic on. Can you kind of tell us what he's saying? All right. Okay. So he built a uh, his own social network, like uh, his own Facebook wow. for like my class. So uh, kids can go on. Everyone has an account. They can uh, friend people just like on Facebook. Upload photos. Upload posts. You know, and you know. Tell whatever they want to everyone. In the David, club. I love this. I'm he a did big, all from scratch. I'm a big fan of you. I'm a big fan of the name, and also what no one else is going to say. Only someone that works at Good Day Sacramento will say this. You could be making a lot more money. Yeah. As being a coder, give back to kids in our area to be able to help teach them. And so I so appreciate this. Uh, these are after-school programs, or you help homeschool kids, right? Yes, I homeschool kids and uh, in the mornings and after school uh, for everyone else. Love it. Sign up for this. It's called Mr. Code's Wild Ride. You cannot forget a name like that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? Yeah, I remember being in school. My brother's five years younger than me. I was. Learning